All right, welcome back, Beowulf Nation. It's I'm Beowulf, back at it with another YouTube video. As you can see here, it's a finished 3D printed Magneto helmet. Um, I went with purple, as this is actually uh, my dad's birthday is today. I've been working on this for a couple of weeks. Took a long time to uh, 3D print it. I plan on redoing a custom color uh, and that'll be on my website, 3dbaywolf.com. Um, but I went with this as there was a time frame. And then I did the same purple before on uh, King the Conqueror helmet. And I know this is, I mean, kind of what I think of uh, Magneto. When I was a kid having Magneto action figure, I strongly recall the helmet was purple uh, that came with the action figure. So I did with that. But then um, I'm going to do a different purple uh, next time and then do the front of it being in a red like a metallic color the hard thing is I was on a time frame with this and uh, basically just wanted to get it done in time to uh, give him as a gift when you're doing different color paint jobs you got to wait for a while them to dry and then mask them off and uh, I just didn't want to put more into it than needed it's just a gift and uh, I'm not even sure if you'll wear it I <laughs> He, I know what I kind of slightly brought it up. He said he's not a fan of Magneto. Uh, but when I was a kid, me and him, uh, every weekend would go to the arcade. And there was an X-Men uh, video game. And I recall the end character to fight was Magneto. And uh, that's kind of kind of another reason why I did that. Then also, too, uh, it's hard to tell in the light. Uh, is I did all this padding in there, too. Um, so that the thing when he, when he's wearing it or somebody else is wearing it, the thing is actually perfectly fitted. Uh, when I measured this thing out, I wanted to make sure it was to my head fitting with it. It's a gift. I'm not going to be hey, ask my dad what my measurements of his head is to fit in the helmet. But then it kind of gives it that good uh, way to that then you can um, take these pads in and out too. Uh, and they're Velcroed on that they can come on and off. And uh, you can wash them, but then it just makes it really cool. Makes it really cool with wearing it. I'm going to tell them is anytime there's a future Marvel movie in the theaters, this is his official helmet. And it's also too kind of looks like a crown on it. So it's a, he's king of his castle with his Magneto helmet. And uh, this one paint that I used, um, it was not a, it was more like I would say a matte purple uh, the finish turned out different, but then it actually gives it some really cool texture to it, actually, that it gives it that effect of it looking like actual metal. Uh, that also, too, where I'm kind of really happy with how this thing turned out uh, with that. Um, but if you, there's a bunch of stuff I'm working on right now, uh, selling, un, you know, where it's just not painted yet or painted Mandalorian armor, uh, got working on a Iron Man Deadpool suit uh, and then there's some like G.I. Joe classified accessories there's a whole bunch of stuff a whole bunch of stuff I need that I finished that I haven't put on my website uh, so check that out 3dbaywolf.com hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, this is pretty cool hope he's gonna like it I'm on the way to their house right now as we speak so uh, if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button uh, also to uh, Hit the bell notification. Check out the Amazon store, amazon.com slash shop slash I am Beowulf. Stay mighty and keep strong.